I was on a routine recon patrol when all hell dropped out of the sky. One second I was on deck, the next I was drifting alone in the Dragon Sea. My fate was a coin flip between the sharks and starvation. And just when it seemed things couldn't get worse, I was captured by pirates from the Shadow Isles. You wanna live, boy? Impress me. The man with the imposing voice was Ped Zhang, warlord of the fierce Shadow Clan, and the one man standing between me and a 60 mile swim. You can start with your name. Lieutenant Shao Kai, Northern League Fleet, Torpedo Squadron 12. Squadron? Where are your ships? Your grunts picked over everything that could float. The rest went down in the attack. Just who launched this assault? The Colonials are gone, and the Jade Kingdom doesn't have anything that powerful. Guess I was too busy sinking to catch their name. I was one nod away from being bait when a vision of beauty appeared at Zhang's side and saved me. His attitude is unfortunate, Lord Zhang, but this one may prove useful. Just like that, my old life was over and a new one about to begin. That was the day I became a Sea Raider for the Shadow Clan. I owe Lord Zhang my life, but I'm not doing this for him, because I know who attacked us. I saw two of our own ships, the Basilisk and the Octopus, tear away after the assault, led by our flagship, the Dragon. I saw them turn the sea red with the blood of our own men. So I'll play Zhang's game for now. But this is about payback. This is about Admiral Xiao Lung of the Northern League, commander of the Dragon, the warthole who wasted my crew. Xiao Lung, my brother. I made a promise on our mother's talisman that day. Lung will pay for what he did. I was on a routine recon patrol when all hell dropped out of the sky. Zhang assigned a ship's mate named Ahmed to bring me up to speed on life, Shadow Clan style. The coastal shipping routes are juicy. Especially the cargo boats out of the Jade Kingdom. When our ships throttle up, there isn't a speeder on the Dragon Sea that can take us. What's with Scarface? That's Gamal the Knife, one of Zeng's pit bulls. Watch him. That's him. Just because you caught Zeng's eye, don't think you're one of us. Man's got to earn the right to run with the Shadow Clan. I'm ready if you are. Consider your first mission a test. All you need to do is sink a rope line of Jade Kingdom sampans at Suepu. An idiot merchant named Anam Park hired them on as protection. And I'm supposed to let him know that was a bad idea? Just make sure you get them all. Think you can handle it, Navy man? I just need three things. A speedboat with chain guns, Ahmed as first mate, and you out of my face.
Sink all enemy sampans in Suepu Bay. Follow Gamal. He'll lead us to the target. Use turbo for a burst of speed. You're on your own, kid. Target's hit it. Let's get started. We've got to sink every last sampan. Chain guns are deadly accurate at close range. Best of all, you never run out of ammo. And Zhang will be pleased. Looks like my Sam Pan Slam did the trick. Because a day later I scored my next mission from a far more attractive source. They call her Lady Helen. No one knows much about her, except you cross her at your peril. And Lord Zhang trusts her with his life. Look at her. Who wouldn't? Shao Kai, your raid has convinced the merchant Pok to extend his hand in friendship. In other words, he's offering the Shadow Clan tribute if we promise not to turn his sampans into toothpicks. Very good. And you get to collect it. The payments have been left at four sites around Sui Pu. Jade Kingdom boats are patrolling the area, so you've been given a rocket launcher for this mission. Use whatever means necessary to enforce our friendship. <laughs>
Collect all four treasure chests. Sink any enemies you meet. Let's get our payment from an armed puck. Kai, let's use the rocket monster. Don't let them get away. With rockets, try to leave the target. Rockets are great against shore targets. They've spotted us, and they're running for it. These Jade Kingdom fools need a lesson. Use the radar to find the enemy. First one, three more to go.
try to be a little more evasive. A few days later, I discovered my first mate, Ahmed, was also a first-rate thief. You stole a war boat! Stole, borrowed, it was just sitting there, fully loaded and complete with auto cannons. <laughs> I'm sorry I asked. Still, this could be our chance to prove ourselves to Zhang. Ah, that's what I thought. There's a small island nearby with a sheltered cove. It's where the Jade Kingdom keeps their munitions cache now. If we could sneak inside and blow it up. Not bad, not bad. And I wouldn't mind showing Zhang's grunts what we can do. But we better get it right, or there will be no coming back. Destroy the munitions. Sink anyone who tries to stop us. Head into the cove. These auto cannons pack quite a punch. Take out those sad pans. Enemy boats! Here come enemy reinforcements.
done it. We'll be heroes. As word of our successful raid spread, Ped Zhang called me in. You've bought yourself some respect, boy. But there's one more challenge before you earn a place with us. All you have to do is circle the island within the line of buoys and get back to the starting dock before time runs out. Of course, it wouldn't be much of a challenge without opponents. So my best pilots will be trying to slow you down. And since Gamal is the current record holder, he may be especially motivated. Great. I'll be sure to wave when I pass him. Oh, and you'll be unarmed. Then I'll dodge him. Stay inside the line of boys. Beware the opposing boats. Beat Gamal's time to the finish line. Stay within the buoys, or we'll lose. Too close to the buoys. Be careful. Keep the buoys on your left. Keep out of their way. A little further. Yeah. 
you don't have a chance, boy. We won, Kai. You beat Gamal's best time. We were still celebrating my victory when Ped Zhang called for me. Even though I'd left Gamal choking on my record time, Zhang looked furious. I hope your victory was more than beginner's luck, boy. Especially now. That you've made captain. <laughs> You're not surprised. Only that you didn't promote me sooner. <laughs> Lady Helen warned me about your attitude. But then you wouldn't be much of a pirate without it. And, uh... We could use another cool head. The future looks treacherous. Something's happened. Your brother, Lung, has seized power in the Northern League. Blood was still running in the Colonial Embassy when Lung decreed himself Khan Grand Warlord of the New Iron Empire. I'm used to death, Kai, but your brother revels in it. He always said he'd rule the Northern League. I just didn't know how far he was willing to go. There's more. Word has it that Lung has secured the Dragon's Claw, a magical weapon that can destroy entire ships with one blast. That must be what he used to wipe out my squadron. I knew you'd held something back. There's more pirate in you than I imagined. My new command came with a new ship, a sleek 40-foot catamaran called the Hellcat. Fully loaded with high-explosive torpedoes and rockets. And now Lady Helen talks to me directly. She likes to play cool face-to-face. -face, but I'm beginning to sense, even hope, that there's more to her than charts and strategy. My sources tell me Lung controls the Northern League Navy. He's been raiding the coast and forcing Jade Kingdom shipping into our waters. It's easy plunder for now. But your brother will turn on us soon enough. I can hardly wait. I hear the Jade Kingdom's developing a backbone. You heard right. They've taken three of our trading junks hostage. They're planning to move them through the Sandbat Channel tomorrow. If they reach port, it's game over. Which is why you're going to take our ships back before they get there. The junks are guarded by a handful of armed escorts. Once they're sunk, the junks will be free to sail home. But watch your back. The Jade Kingdom will destroy what it can't own. We've got to teach them a lesson. I'm prepared to pay well for success. And failure is not an option. Sink the enemy escorts. Rescue our friends. Escort our ships to safety. Head east to intercept the convoy. Sink all the enemy boats. Our comrades will then break for home. You're going to love torpedoes. They have great range and hit hard. One of ours! The enemy is attacking 
the junks. Um, enemy reinforcements. Now we become the escort. Let's get these junks to safety. That lighthouse marks the south channel. Escort the junks to the south channel. Success! Our friends are free again! Zhang was true to his word. My reward for recapturing our ships was generous. But as usual, I didn't have much time to enjoy it. Lady Helen warned this might happen. Elements of the Iron Fleet are raiding coastal villages in the Spiral Islands. They're demanding tribute? From us? What they demand and what they get are two different things. You're going to put an end to this. I've chosen you because you know the Iron Fleet's tactics. But you should also know that your presence has been requested. What? By whom? The local shaman, Sala. 
I don't know how he knows you, so be careful. It could be a trap set by your brother. And one more thing. These raids. They're being led by one of the Iron Fleet's elite patrol boats, the Basilisk. Forget this, Sala. The Basilisk was one of the ships that wiped out my squadron and killed my men. I'm taking this mission for them. Protect the village. Sink all patrol boats. Beware the basilisk. We have help this time. Let's see how they fight. Be more effective. We fight as a team.
more good work after wasting the basilisk i couldn't wait for another shot at the iron fleet but suddenly we had bigger problems. The Jade Kingdom has found our main base here at Maghrib. Their ruler, Lord Brana, is sending an assault group to blockade the port and hem us in. Not if I have anything to say about it. Don't worry. You will. Lord Zeng has ordered a total sweep of our waters. Kai, you'll clear the shipping lanes to the north. All Jade Kingdom boats are to be destroyed. If we make the price high enough, maybe Brana will learn his place. And Kai... Be careful. Be careful. Suddenly I had even more reason to finish them fast. Clear our waters. Sink all enemies you encounter. Boats! Cannons this time! Let's see what they can do. There's another patrol! Coming in from everywhere!
fast. Lord Brana's fleet is in retreat. <laughs> Guess he learned it's better to lose a few ships in our raids than his entire fleet in an all-out war. Brana's learned to run. Now he'll learn to fear. We're gonna sink two of his munition ships right under his nose. Inside Nagao Harbor? I like it. You'll go in tonight after dark. But the main channel's heavily defended. The Delta looks like our best bet. Oh, you're learning. Once inside... Find the two freighters and destroy them. With luck, you can get out before Brahma's forces can react. Lord Brahma has his hands full with the Iron Empire. This should teach him to leave us alone. Infiltrate through the Delta. Sink the freighters. Avoid contact if you can.
Raiders should be moored at the northern pier. Underway! Sink them quickly! Damn, these are tough beasts! Now get the other one! Made it! We're in the clear. Something's wrong. That pig, Brana, has hit back hard. War junks have entered Maghrib Bay itself. Then we have to move. Junks carrying our munitions and acquisitions are loading as we speak. 
We set sail for our fortress on Kerrang in the morning. I'll be leading a counterattack against Brana's fleet, Kai. I want you to head up the convoy's escort. Rendezvous in the Sundered Straits, but watch it. Those islets are an ambush waiting to happen. One more thing. We've learned that your brother has put a price on your head. One of Lord Brana's lieutenants, the Eel, has taken the assignment. And he'll kill you if he gets the chance. Then I better get him first. At least three junks must reach safety. Escort our junks to Kerrang Island. Watch out for the Eel Squadron. Our friends are off to check the new base. Escort the junks. We must protect the convoy. Enemy sampans ahead. Junks under attack. Don't let the attackers get too close.
lost a junk. Don't let it happen again. Check it out! That's our new home! Those must be the eels! Sink them! I'm here. The cargo is safe. The old colonial fortress on Kerrang has become our new home. That was a hell of a fight. Lord Brana's definitely on the warpath. Yeah, I'm not used to being the hunted.
At least we managed to salvage one of those electric guns off of the eel's boat. <laughs> Give me a couple of days. I might even figure out how it works. Keep trying. I've got to see Lord Zhang. Kai, Sala, your shaman friend, has asked for a meeting, something about a gift for saving his village. I don't need any gifts. But I need the villagers' goodwill, so meet them tonight at the inlet on Sea Dog Island. And be careful. Brana's boats are everywhere, and our defenses aren't complete. If he chose to strike now, we'd be in serious trouble. Now, go get this precious gift. Hell, if it's money, I'll only take half my usual cut. You're too kind. We'll rendezvous with Sala and be back in Kerrang for breakfast. Sea Dog Island is just ahead. Hope these enemy patrols haven't found Sala. Let's take them out. Sala. Let's make the rendezvous. Here, Shakai. I had to hide from Branna's scouts. Here is your reward. Lady Helen can explain its significance. Great. When 
and the talisman, like the one you already have. Be careful on your way home. Let's get back to Karain. Jade Kingdom Strike Force heading towards our base. We must attack them at once. That will alert the Shadow Clan.
strike force coming from the north. It's up to us now. Our friends are already engaging the enemy. One of ours! work. We've won. The base is safe. We're at war. The Lord of the Jade Kingdom, Shri Brana, has sent hundreds of war junks and sampans into clan waters, and it's my brother's fault. That scum Lung Khan needs the gold from the opium trade to support his new empire, so he's invaded the supply routes in the Jade Kingdom. Lord Brana will face Lung soon enough, but he's got to get rid of us first. Sure, Brana doesn't need the Shadow Clan biting his ass while he wages war on the Iron Empire. Exactly. We've broken off his first attack, but it's not over yet. Mm, Kai, may I speak with you in private? Especially in private. How much do you know about your parents, Kai? Well, my father died when I was young, and my mother... Was the Lady Shao, heir to nobility and trusted with one part of a powerful mystic relic. The Shield of Five Souls. I knew she came from a proud line, but after that I'm lost. The Shield protects its owner against evil. It's made of five talismans, each with the image of a sacred power. You have two pieces already. The first came from your mother. My good luck piece. The second from that Spiral Island Shaman. Your brother knows about the shield. Once complete, it's the only thing that can deflect the dragon's claw. That's why he's trying to kill you and why he murdered your mother ten years ago. Murder. As soon as I saw your talisman, I knew you were important to our cause. You've got to complete the shield so Lung can be destroyed. Trust me, I'll get it done. I can't believe we're taking out a gun shark. Look at that mine launcher. And she looks fast enough to get us out of trouble. Which is exactly where we're headed. If Brana wants war, I'm ready to give it to him. We're going to blockade his naval base at Nagao. Helen's learned that Brana's top admiral, Lord Malik, has been sent in to rebuild their defenses and lay minefields in the Narrows. But while that keeps us out... It keeps Malik in. If the harbor entrance is the only way out, we can bottle him up. You'll be taking our flank. Make sure no one gets in or out, and if any ships approach, sink them. Let's show these pigs how the Shadow Clan wages war. Blockade Port Nagao. The Royal Junk must not escape. Do not enter the harbor itself. Congratulations on your new command. 
Tigris is an auspicious name. Bring us luck in combat. We have mines now. Perfect for a blockade. Watch it! They're on our side. The enemy is attempting to break our blockade. Near the mines and are breaking out. Enemy boats are joining the fight. be the Admiral. You did it. You took out the Admiral.
job. Head Zhang will be pleased. Lord Zhang was very happy with your last mission, Kai. And pulling Lord Malik from the water was a coup. I'm glad Zhang's happy. Poor Malik cried all the way back to port. He'll bring a healthy ransom. But your brother is still the key. Gather around, people. Yes, my lady. We've just learned that most of Brana's ships are engaging the Iron Fleet at Black Moon. Meaning the Nagao naval base is wide open. For a moment. We've got to destroy as much of the base as we can, particularly the harbor fortifications. Sink all opposition on the water. After this, maybe Lord Brana will finally take his war elsewhere. Destroy all harbor fortifications. Sink all opposition on the water. Let's do it. Today we take Nagao. Target is in sight. Let him have it. are great for strong targets. Watch it! They're on our side! You're hitting one of ours!
fireworks. Must have had an ammunition stash. <laughs> Naga. We had just secured our ships at Kerrang when the alarm sounded. Lord Zhang gathered us together at Dockside. Our attack on Nagao must have hit a nerve. Lord Branas is steaming on Kerrang with a horde of sampans. Unfortunately, most of our ships are out on raids to the west. That leaves us just a handful of boats to defend the port. Nobody's gonna take this port. Kai is right. This is our home. We are Shadow Clan, and we will stand. Sink all attackers. Protect our ships and fuel tanks. Looks like we're in for a tough fight. The timing of this attack is too lucky for Brana. There must be a spot among the Shadow Clan. The Junks are attacking our gunner placements. Something different about these sand pads. They're loaded with explosives. They're like giant torpedoes. Suicide. Those boat crews must be crazy. Don't let them come near us. But don't let them get past us either. We have to keep our cargo junk safe. One of ours! I don't think Brana can afford to try that again. Our buddies are gone. We're on our own now.
was hellish, but it's over. We've won. That wasn't a battle. That was a massacre. Still, I've got to admit, Brana's men fought hard. Hard or not, next time we go toe-to-toe, -to -toe, they'll be shocked by this electrical stinger gun. I've almost got it wired in. Keep at it. Lady Helen's called another briefing. This war must end. Lord Zeng has ordered an assault on the main Jade Kingdom munitions depot up the Nagao River. I'm not going to lie to you. The depot is heavily defended and almost impossible to reach. But if you get past the shore batteries on the riverbank, you might be able to hit their supply dump. With luck, a few of you might even survive. Kai? Lady Helen. I've just learned that the third piece of the shield is in a temple upriver from the target. You must recover it. But the depot... Means nothing unless we stop long. Our future's in your hands, Kai. Get past the shore batteries. and blow up the munitions depot. Pick up the third piece of the shield. This attack should finally break them. got their attention now.
the ammo dump and blow them up. and holes in our boat. Let's destroy this ammo dump.
Got him. Another eel pickled in brine. We got it. I hope this thing is worth the trouble. We've done it. Bron has requested a peace conference. Lady Helen's leaving tomorrow to rendezvous with Bronna's royal junk at the monastery on the Talon Rock. The monks have offered their hermitage as neutral ground for the talks. So why do I think this is leading up to a really dangerous mission? Because it is. My sources tell me Lang has sent out a flotilla led by the torpedo boat Octopus. He's determined to prevent an armistice. Knowing your history with that particular ship, I thought you might want to be my escort. You'd have to kill me to keep me away. Escort Lady Helen. Protect the rendezvous at Talon Rock. The octopus is the main threat. Get Lady Helen to the rendezvous point. Some uninvited guests.
arrived at the appointed place. There's Lord Brunner now. Brunner has arrived. Be vigilant. Here come the party crashers. Danger! Now this deal can be sealed in peace. We finally have a treaty with the Jade Kingdom, meaning the real war is about to begin against my brother, Xiao Long. Well, that was interesting. After spending months attacking Lord Brana's forces, suddenly he's thanking you for saving his ship. I especially like that little bow he threw in at the end. Bare chest, gold rings, big teeth. I felt like putting my knee into his face. Uh, was that before or after he kissed Lady Helen's hand? Hmm? As she seemed quite charmed. Don't you have a ship to scrub or something? Wait, looks like Lord Zhang's ready. We have an accord. Now the Jade Kingdom and the Shadow Clan will take the battle to Lung Khan together. We're going to hit him where it hurts. If we can close the opium routes, Shaolung's gold will be cut off. No gold, no fleet. Exactly. Our first target will be the port city of Black Moon. Their walls are heavily guarded, so we need to go in hard and fast. But now, we have two fleets! And more important, Kai. Lord Brana tells me the fourth piece of the shield may be in that area. If we complete the shield, we just might have a chance. Get ready, Long. Your time is coming. The next mission is under Lord Brana's personal command. 
I'm used to taking orders, but the idea of running errands for this pampered aristocrat makes me sick. I'll try and make this as simple as possible, Commander Kai. I need you to lead a high-speed rescue mission into the occupied harbor at Black Moon. Black Moon's still heavily guarded. We go in, we're taking fire. Who are we after? The Prime Minister? A princess? You're retrieving the royal jewels. Um, excuse me? We were rushing to get them out when the Iron Fleet took Black Moon. They're hidden in unmarked crates, so they might still be in place. And this is worth risking a ship and crew? We may need that money to fund our offensive, and since I'm not used to explaining myself to pirates, consider this meeting adjourned. Sneak in through the Delta. Infiltrate Black Moon Bay. Fetch me my treasure. Rana's men will distract the enemy. Get into the Delta. It's the only way. Watch for enemy patrol boats. Tuck the shore to hide from the guns. One chest. We need at least two more. That's two chests. One to go.
got away. Lord Branagh will love you. General alarm sounded, and I could see from Lady Helen's face that it was serious. We're in trouble. An Iron Fleet flotilla is approaching Kerrang. And the docks are loaded with munitions. One good hit and we can kiss this harbor goodbye. We've got to stop Lung's ships before they open fire. That could be a problem. The fleet's at sea with Lord Zhang, and our boat's in dry dock. We have two fleets now, remember? We'll use one of Brana's eel-class attack boats. Lady Helen... How do they know to hit us now? Do you think Brana's working both sides of the fence? I hope not, but there may be a traitor in our midst. Be careful, Kai. Smash the attacking fleet. Protect our munitions. To arms! Let's slaughter these intruders! We must stop them from hitting our base! They're coming in fast! Brana's men went full out during the last attack. 
If he's a traitor, he's hiding it well. Are you disappointed? Among other things, but we can discuss it after Lady Helen's briefing. I have good news. Lung Khan is sending an Iron Fleet convoy of troops and cargo transports into Black Moon Bay. That's good news? It is when their escort is light, and they've decided to run through the Emerald Straits. It's perfect for an ambush, if we can just get close enough. Wait, didn't we just capture an Iron Fleet patrol boat? If we approach the convoy in their own ship, those Imperial simps might think they're meeting their own escort. I only wish I could be there when you open fire. So do I. Sink the convoy and its escorts. We need to sink all the freighters in this convoy. Remember, Kai, we're in disguise. Use it to our advantage. Once we attack, our cover is blown. Have their attention now. Think of them. or we're done for. Good work. What a bounty of salvage. I think there are three more freighters.
sank the freighter. Lung Khan's convoy went down in flames, and Zhang rewarded us with our most powerful ship yet. A Razorback torpedo boat, autocannons, rockets, torpedoes, and mines. Oh, I think I'm in love. We have got to get you out more. Just make sure she's in fighting shape. Word is our next mission's a big one. Lord Brana wants his port back. The Shadow Clan's gonna get it for him. Kai, you'll escort three war junks carrying a complement of Lord Brana's Royal Marines into the outer harbor of Black Moon Bay. Brana again. What a thrill. You'll clear the waters and coastal defenses so they can reach shore. Then Brana's troops will assault and capture the gate. We're gonna rip Black Moon right out of Lung Khan's hands. Make sure it hurts. Rana's Royal Marines. Clear a path through the mines. They must reach the landing site. Defend the junks at all costs! Take out the shore batteries! with torpedoes.
lost one of the junks. We cannot afford to lose another junk. You're hitting one of ours! Hitting one of ours. have made it to shore. The assault on Black Moon Bay was brutal, and Lord Brana brought even more bad news. My troops are inside, but the Imperial garrison still controls the inner waterways, and Lunkon's fleet is closing fast. I don't think my men can hold the port. Then we'll let it go. The fourth piece of Kai's shield is hidden in a sunken temple upriver from the harbor. We've got to get it. Whatever the cost, Kai, you'll have to punch through their shore defenses and patrols to reach the temple. Make some noise. This is no time to be subtle. Are you insane? Lung and the dragon are almost here. His dragon's claw could destroy the entire fleet in minutes. How can you possibly get the talisman in time? I don't explain myself to pampered aristocrats. Now ready my ship, I can make it. Get the relic from the sunken temple. Escape before the dragon arrives. Head up river and 
Find the temple. We must attack everything in our path. Steady. Must be near.
out fast. Lung's fleet is coming. Everything! We got away. One piece. Black Moon was a disaster, and every scream was etched across Lady Helen's face. We've driven the Iron Fleet out of the Jade Kingdom and retrieved the fourth talisman, but at a terrible price. Lung used the Dragon's Claw to destroy the harbor. Black Moon Bay is gone. Even Gamal and his hydroplane have gone missing. But my brother's been stung. Without his opium money, Lung's in trouble. His mercenaries will start to bolt. The time's come to push into his waters, so you can face him yourself. We take out Lung, the Iron Empire falls with him. But there's still something else, isn't there? Something you haven't told me. Shao Lung's treason didn't start with his war, Kai. Even when the Colonials ruled the Northern League, Admiral Lung was selling weapons and slaves to fund his ambitions. I was sent by the colonial governor to infiltrate his operation. You were a spy? Until Lung's informants found me out. Then I was his prisoner. Chained, tortured, and worse. Lung himself supervised many of the sessions. You can't imagine how much I hate your brother. When I escaped, I couldn't return home. I joined Zeng praying for a revenge that seemed almost impossible. Until you arrived. You have the power to bring him down, Kai. I know Lung has the fifth talisman. When I find out where, you'll be able to avenge us both. Promise me. She kissed me. A moment I'd anticipated for months. But all I could taste was her pain. It was like my brother had found me. Even here, I will see him burn in hell. Whoa. 
The Iron Fleet's patrols were thinning out, and Lady Helen was determined to take advantage. Preparations for our offensive have begun. We've started moving supplies to our staging areas in the north. Kai, you and your squadron will escort a flotilla of supply junks through the Emerald Straits and make our depot on the edge of the Iron Empire. Our scouts tell us the enemy fleet is spread out to the south, so you should have reasonably clear sailing. Why do I feel a butt coming? Just stay alert. I don't like it when things seem too easy. Escort our convoy. Once you're through the straits, you should be safe. Let's get these supply junks to our forward base. Be wary of Iron Fleet assassins. Here they come. Don't stray too far from our convoy. Let's show them what this boat can do. Oh! 
Germans are ripping the convoy to pieces! still alive. What? I thought he went down at Black Moon. We all did. But it was a ruse. He's been the traitor all along. I should have given that warthole another scar when I had the chance. It gets worse. You know that new boat technology we've been developing? He's stolen the prototype and is trying to sell it to Lung Khan. If my brother gets his hands on that prototype, we could lose this war. Where's Gamal now? We've learned he's going to be demonstrating the boat at the Kunbei Naval Base tomorrow. Kunbei? Hell, I practically grew up there. Then you know a frontal assault would be a suicide. Yeah, but I also know that base inside and out, and there's a hidden tunnel that bypasses the main gate. It's only open at low tide, and we'll need a small boat to get through. Still, if you can get inside past the guards at the gate, I'll give Gamal a demonstration of my own. Well, just watch yourself. As much as I want Gamal dead, I want you back alive. Sneaking through the hidden tunnel. Then find Gamal and sink him. After we sink Gamal, we must escape quickly. another way in.
find Gamal. That traitor will pay. Will pay with his life. No choice but to surrender. We've been taken prisoner by the Iron Fleet and dragged to their base at Devil's Shoals. My brother Lung Khan was there to greet us. Ah, little brother. Tell me, how have you been? Come closer. I'll show you. <laughs> you haven't changed. You're still a nuisance. Like that business with Gamal. Impressive. Fortunately, the hydroplane is still salvageable. Even if he isn't. And thank you for bringing me the other four talismans. Once I unite them with the final piece at Kunbe, the shield belongs to me, and I'll be able to destroy your pirate friends once and for all. This isn't over, Long. It was over before it started. You were the only one who could have stopped me, and now you're mine. You've taken a heavy toll among my men, so I'm going to let them finish you in the arena. You'll have a boat and weapons, and there's no way out. And sooner or later, you will die. Give my regards to our mother when you see her. Give my regards to the devil. You'll see him soon enough. Kai. Kai. One of the guards is friendly to our cause. 
He says Northern League loyalists will try to get us out of the arena. If we last long enough, tell him we'll be ready. Let's see how long you last in my arena, boy. Let the battle begin. Not to survive until our friends can help us. To win, we must defeat ten patrol boats. They're jumping in through those openings. On the gate! Enemy ahead!
We escaped Lung's games and recovered Gamal's hydroplane in the bargain. Lung's security didn't put up much of a fight. She could use a paint job, but she's still seaworthy. And this wave gun is amazing. I can't wait to test her out. Good, because we're not done yet. Looks like Lung Khan's loaded the four pieces of the talisman on a freighter heading for Kung Bay. Huh, so much for shore leave. Let me guess. We've got to capture that ship before it gets to the Emerald Straits and bring it to safety. Well, what is hell? You wanted a test, pal. You're gonna get it. We must intercept the freighter and sink the escorts. Before the convoy reaches the Emerald Straits. Blow up torpedoes with the wave gun. Forget the spotter. We need to sink those destroyers.
elevator is nearly safe. Finish off the pursuers. Got the talismans back. We made it. It was great to be back in Kerrang. And Zhang, as usual, arranged one hell of a homecoming. But we had little time to celebrate. Lung Kong's furious over your escape, but for once his anger's gotten the best of him. He's leading the dragon and his fleet on a hunt to find you. While he's away, we'll attack Kun Bei. Lord Brana will lead the assault. I can't wait to hear this plan. Your pirates will clear the way. Then a war junk with a squad of my elite commandos will land and take over. They're bound to have my secret tunnel corked up by now, but there's a small landing down a side channel off the main harbor approaches. Ah, excellent. Once in position, my men will blow the inner harbor wall and our combined forces can invade. If you and your pirates approve, of course. Approve? Hell, the fifth talisman's in there. And I want it. Clear a path for my commandos. Get them to their landing area. Clear the way for the troop transport. The biggest threat will be destroyers and shore batteries. Troop transport. Careful! That's a friendly! We need to get that junk to the side entrance of the port.
torn up. We need to protect it. have arrived! This war will be ours. Let's hope Branna's commandos are as good as he thinks they are. While the battle continued in the outer harbor, Brana called us to his royal junk to discuss her next move. Our first attack failed. My commandos could only crack the inner wall. We may have to consider retreat. There will be no retreat. We'll use one of your tricks. Pack three war junks with explosives and ram the harbor gates. That should do it. Kai will rendezvous with the bomb junks. I want you to lead them into the outer harbor and then wait for them to blow the gate. Once you've made the inner compound, find the secret harbor. The final piece of the shield is kept there, and it will be heavily defended. I'll get inside. Count on it. Lung's fleet is already on its way. I'll hold them off until you have the last talisman. The entire fleet? That's suicide! Dad, you those can't... are my orders! But... Kai, listen to me. You've got to complete the shield. All we've been through, it'll mean nothing unless Lung Khan is defeated. You've been like a son to me. And whether we meet here or in the afterlife, that much will never change. Forget the hereafter, old man. Just make sure you come back. Escort the bomb junks to the gate. The talisman is hidden somewhere inside. We need to clear the way for our bomb junks. They'll blow up the gate to the inner harbor. Then we'll be able to grab the last talisman. You're hitting one of ours!
gate is to the north. We made it! Who knew we could fly? Now let's get what we came for. Get out of here! We've got 
got the final piece, but nothing's happening. Looks like company. Let's get out of here. Our junks finally cracked the gates. South to the rendezvous point. We have the shield. Ted Zhang will be proud of us. Ted Zhang is dead. He was killed in the assault on the dragon, burned to ash by a blast from Lung's claw. He may have been a pirate, but he rescued me from the sea. He didn't just save my life, he gave me a new one, brought me into the Shadow Clan, taught me the ways of the Sea Raiders, trusted me, became like the father I'd never known, and my brother destroyed him. Tonight, as our remaining ships were readied for battle, we said goodbye to Ped Zhang. Flames licked the mast of his pirate junk, casting a weird light against the gathering clouds. I felt Helen standing behind me before she spoke. I should have seen this coming. Ped died seeking my revenge. Our revenge. My brother started this. Lord Zhang died to give us a chance to finish it. One way or another, this is going to end. At last, the shield is complete with the fifth and final piece fitting securely into place. And with Ped Zhang's death, the Shadow Clan and Lord Brana have turned to me for leadership. I can feel Zhang's hand on my shoulder as I take command. Lord Zhang's attack took out the dragon's rudder. She's dead in the water, for now. What are your orders? Send out our last torpedo squadron. I'll join them in the hydroplane. We have to finish the dragon before she can be repaired. Even half-wrecked, the dragon will be a formidable target. And heavily protected. You've got to tell me how to use the shield. It was designed to defeat the dragon's claw, redirect the claw's energies. That's how the shield gets its power. But I have no idea how it truly works. Get close to Lung's flagship and trust your instincts. You'll make it work. Don't worry. We'll test it on my brother's ship and see how he likes being the hunted for once. Sink the dragon. working now. Hung and his dragon's claw must be nearby. Lady Helen said the dragon's claw would activate the shield. Watch it! They're on our side. Careful! That's a friendly! Enemy ships are closing fast. Got our friends with his dragon's claw. Watch out 
for their minds. Destroyer to the bottom. Lung. Hey, that's Lung. He's getting away. Shao Lung, you are a coward. The warthole ran took his private launch to his base up the Blood River. The Iron Empire is over, Kai. Lung's fleet is in ruins. His troops are deserting. It's not enough. He's going after him. I know the shield destroyed the Dragon's Claw, but it was consumed too, and Lung still has his elite Iron Guard for protection. Kai knows all that, but this isn't about the odds. It's about his brother. If I don't go now, Lung will be back. This is the only way to stop him. Tonight's for my family, for Ped Zhang, for Helen, for all the thousands my brother murdered. Tonight, we'll answer to our ancestors, together. We'll fight past Lung's Iron Guard. Lung will be hiding in his citadel. I don't like the look of this. The very sky seems to be on fire. These tight canyons, perfect for ambushes. So many choke points, perfect for mines. Use your wave gun on the mines. Save your rockets for bunkers. I thought we sank them all!
Starting to hate caves.
Long Citadel. I should have drowned you when you were an infant. So you've come from hiding, brother. You will pay for your crimes. I could see our ship stretching to the horizon as Helen joined me at the balcony. We're merging what's left of the Iron Fleet with our own ships. The new fleet should be able to protect the Dragon Sea against the return of my colonial brethren. Or any other threat. Lord Brana is leaving now that the negotiations are done. Damn it, I never did get to punch him. Good thing, since I hear he's offered you a command. In Brana's navy? I don't think so. Besides, I've seen enough war for a while. What about you? My life's been about revenge for so long. I'm not sure where to go next. For the moment, I'll be returning to the Shadow Isles. The clan needs to choose a new warlord. Unless you're up for the job. Me? Take Zhang's position? No, it just wouldn't feel right. Perhaps the clan should be considering a woman for the job. Perhaps you're right. Where do you go from here? I'm a sailor. I'm going to sail. Ahmed's managed to find us another ship, and the Dragon Sea is waiting. Here's to the future.